So you want to export your amazing 3D models into your game, but when you do, it ends up looking like this, not what you wanted. Let me show you how to fix it. First is understand why it goes wrong. The issue is because of Blender material groups and the nodes, and how it tries but fails to read these when baking your texture maps. What you need is a PBR add-on to assist with baking your textures and cycles. These are some PBR add-ons built for Blender. The first is Simple Bake. You'll get some amazing results with this one. Another is PBR Texture Bakery that works with Cycles and EV. Last is my preference because it does PBR baking well, but most importantly, it's free. This is Principled Baker. Okay, let's get this installed. First click Code, then download the zip and save it to your machine. In Blender, click Edit, Preferences, Add-ons, and then Install. Now browse to download a zip. Once it's installed, verify the checkbox is enabled. A quick tip to save this add-on when you reopen Blender every time is to click the small hamburger menu and then choose Save Preferences. Now make sure you're in Cycles Render Engine and if you have the option, change it to GPU Compute for rendering. Head over to the Shading tab or bring up the Material window and click on your mesh. To open Principal Baker, make sure that you have your mouse hovered over the Material Node window and press N or click on the little arrow to open up the context menu. Browse for Principled Baker tab and you will see the add-on. For the material, there's an auto detect button, but you can uncheck this and choose which channels you wanna bake. I selected the channels which were color, metallic, roughness, and normal, because these are what I use in game engines. Choose the output resolution. You can choose between one and 4K. Remember, the larger the resolution, the longer it takes cycles to bake. Before baking, make sure your mesh is UV unwrapped. You can do this by clicking the mesh and pressing U with the mouse over the 3D viewport or in the UV tab. Once you're ready, click the bake on the principal baker button. A quick way to get them into your model and ready for export is to make a new material for your mesh. Now, back in Edit Preferences add-ons, search for the Node Wrangler add-on. Enable it and head back to the Materials window. Left click on the principal BSDF node and press Ctrl, Shift and T at the same time on the keyboard. This will open the window and you can browse for your newly baked textures. Select them all and import. You will see Node Wrangler is all hooked up, all the materials and textures for you. Now you're ready for export. Now click File Export, choose FBX, make sure selected object is checked. At the top right, make the path to copy and enable the button of the right of it for packing the textures inside the FBX. Once you're done, click Export. Now you can see your model's complete and you can bring it into Unity or Unreal Engine. No problem. Hope this helps and subscribe for more videos.